All right, what's good, homies? Uh, I made a post on Reddit, and uh, lots of people ask me how I played on my cell phone. Uh, I didn't feel like explaining to each and every person how to do it. I would have, but easier just to make a video, to be honest. All right, so what you what you're gonna want to do? You're gonna want to go to the app store, right? Give it. Yes, you're gonna want to search up Puffin. This only works on iOS, by the way. Search up Puffin, get this one right here, download it. it. Doesn't take up too much space. Don't get any of this other crap. Get Puffin web browser, download it, open it up. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Oh, okay. It's gonna ask you. <clears throat> oh, bloody hell. It's gonna ask you if you want the. the optimized version for mobile or whatever there's gonna be another option for flash support it's gonna you're gonna see flash supported choose on that one don't even read the other one because it's baiting you just choose on that flash supported one you're good once you get that you're gonna want to type in realm the mad god.com once you get that should be gucci then full screen it there should be a box like right here like around there if you can't find that just click on theater you should be good Open the gamepad, open the trackpad, because you're going to use both of them to set this up. Once you get that, go to servers, click on your best, click on your actual server, because I don't know why, but like, clicking on best server doesn't actually get you to your, to your best server all the time. It's like not guaranteed, you know? Um, once you're there, just log in. It's pretty self-explanatory. So you head into the game, okay? Got your gamepad open. You got your trackpad open, right? Click on the little keyboard on the bottom left. Click on the O. Open the options, okay? Now, these options right over here, these buttons, it'll be like space, enter, escape, and X or something. Something like that. You want to click on the gears. Actually, I'll get to that later. Anyways, for these controls, I swear, th these, are the, these are the parts that people really just can't understand. That's cool. Like, when I watched Stayback's video on Puffin, I I didn't get it either, man. I really, I was like, I, what I used to do is I said, man, set this to W right here, set that to W, set that to D, set this to whatever. I used to do that, and like, I was like, man, what can I, I, I swear, how do I just move with the gamepad? No, 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 no. I'll give you the key to success right here, all right? Here's what you gotta do. You gotta click on it, move up, you just gotta take the gamepad and like pull it up just like this. You're just setting it to move. You're like coding the gamepad, if that makes sense. Just put it down or you can just tap in that direction. You move it right and you move it left. It's, it's, it's that easy. It really is just that easy, man. And that's all you wanna, worry. don't worry about any of this other stuff. Don't worry about camera rotation, mini rotation. Oh, please don't change mini rotation. Hotkeys. Just, that's that's it for controls, hot keys. And now you're gonna wanna use the mini map, zoom in and zoom out, because that little tiny thing, you're not gonna wanna have to just do that every single time. If you, someone calls a tea room or something, someone calls boss in a snake pit, someone calls boss in chambers and you don't wanna miss on your loot because the event is cold, you're gonna wanna set the mini map zoom out to any button, any V, all right, these two buttons right here, this one, the top one, and the left one. You're just gonna wanna set that to any like key that you don't regularly use. Now, how you can change that, you just click on the gear, and then you click on the V thing, and then click on I, or, sorry. Click on the top one, and that can like, I open a panel, and you just can set it to anything. Don't, don't, don't. Don't set it to this. Okay, don't do that. Just go to alphabet, click any letter. I just chose V and I. I don't know. I just did. And I stuck with it. Set that to just just hit done. Okay. And then for the next one, open that up. Choose any letter you want. Don't choose like your Nexus key, space bar, R, E, camera rotation. No, just choose two random letters, okay? It's gonna be your zooming in and zooming out. Now, what you wanna do. For the, the right one, this one right here, you wanna save this one for your Nexus key. And the reason you wanna do this one instead of like the top left or the bottom one 
is because this one is conveniently out of the frame of your game. I swear, I don't know if it's like, it's just convenient like that. Set this one to your actual Nexus key. Don't set it to like function. Don't set it to modifier, none of this garbage. You don't want none of that. You, want, you don't want any of that either. You don't want any of this. Go to alphabet and go to your actual Nexus key. If it's F, set it to F. If it's E, set it to E. You know, if it's Z, set it to Z, bro. Like, just set it to your actual Nexus key. That way, when you're in trouble and you're actually, like, you actually need a like, Nexus, Nexus, then you're good. And then you just muscle memory, just like, oh, F, click on it. Like, you just have that, like, that, that sense to just know where your Nexus key is. After this, after this long of playing the game, I just know where it is immediately it's just like i don't know it's like putting your hands up when like like a bee comes to your face just like you just know what to do anyways i'm getting off topic set your mini map set your mini map zoom in and zoom out to the top and left key this one and this one and then set your escape to nexus key don't forget to bind it don't forget to bind the key before you get into the game it's just a dumb way to die your star requirement, I don't really care what you do for the chat one, to be honest. But I just like having it at five because it's a convenient middle point between light blue stars, like funny stuff like blue star stuff saves. But it's not like you're getting raped in the chat by spam bots. I mean, you'll still get some, but like you can just block them. I filter offensive language off. I just personally like it having it off because, you know, <laughs> I'm a big boy. Graphics, um, you don't want this, okay? I know you usually play like this, or at least I do, so I can just see what's more in front of me, but you don't want that, okay? You just want it centered because you're not gonna be able to rotate your screen at all when you're on Puffin. It's just a convenient equal vision around yourself. I'd say a little more on the top, but no, excuse me. Nonetheless, just keep it on centered. Turn off draw shadows that causes lag a lot. UI quality, oh my gosh, it's like night and day when you turn it off. I'm getting, I'm getting some lag, but that's, that's, not, that's not important. Custom cursor, it doesn't do anything, so I wouldn't even mess around with that. Show tiers, that's up to you. HP bars, honestly, that's up to you, but for the least amount of lag, I set it to self and enemy. H, high, just set this to low. Don't, it's not even like negotiable at that point. What do you need high particles for? Turn off the sound because it's literally the epitome of cancer. And for experimental, I just, I mean, honestly, I would turn most of these on just to reduce lag. Unless you like got an iPhone X and a $10,000 modem. I don't know. But still, just turn, just turn most of them off. And like, to be honest, should be good. Um, that's pretty much it for the controls. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Once you're done with that, oh yeah, another thing. Whenever you load into Puffin for the first time trying to play some realm, you're always gonna be set sent to the tutorial. Like if you're wondering, oh man, why am I always sent to the tutorial? It's just how it is. I don't know why. I mean, it's not. I mean, at first it's annoying. It's like, man, I just want to get into the game. But it takes like, once you really get fast at it, you start getting to like really do it quickly. You can get into the game in like a minute. It's really not even that bad. Once you're done, you're gonna load into the game and you're gonna be set onto the realm. Cause this is what usually happens. Cause you've never been to the Nexus before. So it can't send you to the Nexus. Just hit your Nexus seat and you're just sent to the Nexus. Just like that. It's annoying. This really goose me up sometimes. Ooh, two backpacks. Ooh, lit, aesthetic. It's nice. I mean, it's lagging now. It looks laggy, but that's my internet. If you have good internet, you should be good. I'm just, I'm using a VPN right now and it's just lag as freak. It's just, I mean, it is what it is, but if you got good internet or even decent internet, should be good. Cause the VPN is basically somewhere in our, like Iraq and the ping is just super high and the lag is just super bad. So it is, it's whatever. There's a few, few tips before you get into the game. I learned, I learned all this stuff the hard way. Nobody told me what to look out for. Nobody told me what to watch out for. And that cost me some serious characters. And I, I was stinging, bro. I was twisted with a rage. Anyways, you're going to get into the game. 
and you're going to be like, well, how do I shoot? Number one, move with your left thumb, aim with your right thumb. Don't try and like move with your left thumb into position, aim with your right thumb, move with your left thumb, and then aim with your left thumb or whatever. No, 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 no. What you want to do is go practice, move with your left thumb, aim with your right thumb. Don't try and mix that up. Just do it just like that because if you need to, you can move out the way and nexus at the same time instead of move out the way with your left. Oh, I don't know. I'm just confusing myself. I'm just confusing myself. Anyways, what's going to happen when you get into the game? You might experience this. I did it myself. You're going to be moving in a direction. You're going to be moving. You're going to be moving. And this is going to lag in a certain direction. It's going to lag in a certain direction. And you're just going to keep moving into that direction. Uh, it's hard to, like, showcase it when I'm lagging. But everybody's downstairs. And I don't want to, like, get no background noise. You feel me? But, like, it's just hard to explain. You're going to move in a direction. You're going to let go of the gamepad. Like, you're going to let go of the control thing. Actually, let me go into my vault because there's less lag in there. Let me, let, me, let me just show you what I'm talking about in my vault. Because it's just, or even a bizarre, man. Here we go. Hope I don't crash no run. Okay, we're good. It's a little less laggy in here. Okay, so I forgot to turn something on. Hold up. I'll turn this on to all. Am I crashing around, bro? No, I think we're good. Anyways, you're gonna be moving in a direction. You're gonna keep moving. I okay, okay. I think that was lag, but you're gonna move in a direction, and um, you're gonna let go of the gamepad, and it's gonna keep moving you in a direction. That's gonna string you. It's gonna shoot you straight into bullets that you don't want to be in, and you're gonna die, and it's gonna get you killed, and you're gonna be mad. How you fix that is you just turn your cursor around in a circle really quick. Like, you might die if you don't do it quick enough. Because that's like the only way. I mean, that's the only way to get out of the lock. That makes sense. The quicker you do it, the quicker you get out of it. And the quicker you can get out of danger. Oh, popping dead water dots. I'm not going in that mug. <laughs> I'm going to lag and die. Anyways. Tip number two, don't do anything in Lost Halls other than cultists. Cultists is so easy. I can do it on a 08 with a horror stack. But no, why are you why stopping a horror stack? I can do it at 08 with a T0 stack. Just don't do Marvel Colossus. Don't do Void. You're going to die. I tried it one time. Cut my losses there. I ain't doing it again. So at least I got more clout, that is. Just try not to go into meticulously dodging situations because you might, like, end up actually, like, getting that bug where you just keep moving in the direction even though you let your fingers off of the gamepad. It's going to get you killed, and it's really, really, really frustrating. Um, I think that's the only thing left. Oh, I mean, this is just a common realm tip, but if you're lagging, open up the keyboard hit O and then hit back to home. Um, sh you should be good then. Don't gamble what you can't afford to lose. It's just, don't, just don't do it, man. Just don't do it. If you're there in the Lost Halls, expecting to do a Marvel Colossus and avoid, you're gonna die. You're just gonna die. Don't do it. Um, oh yeah. Okay, um, hold up. See this? Okay, if someone... Okay, I'm gonna whisper this dude. Okay, now, if you whisper somebody, how you can reply... Oh, man, this dude needs to reply to me. You gotta reply to me. Okay, let's try this dude. Let's try a different approach. This man was completely unresponsive when I yelled penis at him. Oh, oh, that's my weakness. That's my weakness. Anyways, how you want to reply to PMs and stuff? See these arrow keys right here? These arrow keys at the end of this line? 
You just click those. It don't matter if you click up or down. Both of them will react to you. Like, whoa, whoa, watch, 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 watch. Open up. Hit that arrow key. Just opens up the tail. Yup. And you just reply to them or not. It's cool. Um, it's pretty much it. I don't really, I don't really have anything else to say. That's pretty much all I learned by myself. And nobody else have like a really good puffin tutorial. So I guess I just make this one. Um, I'm trying to think because I don't, I really don't like. I'm not about to edit this video at all. Um, I'm just trying to like put it, put all my knowledge into one video. You want to pick up your loot with the tracker? I don't mean, I don't, I hard, that's not, oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Um, I need graphing health pods. Actually, no, not really. That's too much time. Anyways, if you're if you're like, what you can do if you're lagging and you don't want a nexus, I don't know why you wouldn't do that. You can actually spam health pods just straight up by tapping them. It's in a perfectly convenient area that you can just tap it, and it's just don't forget that. Like, if you don't want a nexus and you know you won't die, just tap those health pods. Like, legit, actually, like, try and hit those health pods. <laughs> it, it, it may seem like you won't be able to, but you can, okay? And another thing, like, if you're playing wizard or something, don't off-center your things because someone might come up behind you. And, like, how you have, how you want to, like, aim, like, if you're on cult bus, you know, the soulbound phase for Colt. You can just aim with your right thumb if he's on the right side of you and just like put your thumb on the boss and hit space bar a few times, you know, you know, a few times. Or if he's on the left side of you, put your thing, put your own left thumb on the boss and hit space bar. That, that, it sh should work. I mean, just it's puffing. So, what 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 can you do, man? Honestly, just stay away from Marble Colossus and Void, or Void. I mean, Void for sure. Marble Colossus. If you want to die, do it, man. I mean, go ahead. But uh, I think that's really all I have to say, man. Uh, yeah. Uh, another thing, oh yeah, one last thing, one last thing. Doing this does not save you. That doesn't save you. Trust me, you do think it does, but it doesn't. You're still in the game and you will die. You're gonna log back in just to find out that your character's dead, okay? So, uh, hope this helped. Everybody on Reddit, hit me up. Ask them for stuff, I mean, that's, all these people asking for stuff. Really, that's that's all I can tell you.